Akshay, you have uh, gone to Guwahati to track all that political movement uh, and those rebel MLAs uh, over there uh, camping inside a hotel there in Guwahati. Uh, what is the latest? Because as of now, we have seen from jets flying to Guwahati to Chief Minister Udav Thakre vacating his uh, Chief Minister's residence in Mumbai. So tell us all the action around you in Guwahati. Well, right now we are outside uh, Radisson Blue Hotel that is at the outskirts of Guwahati. Now, uh, this hotel has been seeing uh, political movement since the morning earlier. Uh, initially, Himit Biswa Sarma, the Chief Minister of uh, Assam, uh, was uh, here. He, in fact, uh, uh, supervised the entire situation. Uh, then he came out. Uh, he uh, went out of the hotel. And uh, about an hour later, uh, about 34 MLAs reached here, out of which 30 MLAs were from Shiv Sena, four were independent MLAs. And then later, uh, at around 7 p.m., four more MLAs joined, which, made, uh, which makes it 33 Shiv Sena MLAs who are now inside the hotel and uh, about about uh, five uh, MLAs that are uh, five independent MLAs from Maharashtra, which has taken the total number of MLAs that are here in this particular hotel to 38. Uh, when uh, spoken with, uh, when uh, when uh, some uh, journalists spoke with uh, the Chief Minister of Assam about the entire political crisis of Maharashtra and the MLAs who are staying here, he uh, denied of having any information about the MLAs and said that if anybody wants to come to Assam, they are welcome and that in fact promotes the tourism of the state. However, he uh, stopped short of uh, stating another fact and that was that four uh, leaders from the Bharti Janta Party from Assam are also staying in this hotel. Two are ministers of the government, one is a member of parliament, one is an MLA. So uh, four uh, BJP leaders who are considered extremely close uh, to Hemant Biswas Sarma, they are in fact supervising the entire situation. The security as you can see, there are police officials that are guarding uh, the, this particular hotel. Nobody is allowed inside the hotel without uh, proper checking. Uh, Nobody is allowed inside the hotel without a proper proper reason or proper ID card, even journalists are not allowed inside the hotel. So in a way, proper political patronage is being provided by the Assam government uh, to all of these MLAs uh, without uh, the Chief Minister stating uh, the, the obvious thing that is happening here in Assam. Uh, the BJP government in Gujarat earlier provided pat patronage to Eknath Shinde and the uh, rebel MLAs of uh, Shiv Sena and now it is the Assam government that is providing uh, same kind of political patronage uh, to all of these MLAs. Uh, the number games is very important as far as Shiv Sena's uh, uh, future is concerned, as far as the Thakri's future is concerned and if four more MLAs join uh, these MLAs, these rebel MLAs, then uh, the, the government of the Thakre, in fact, his hold on the party will be uh, in, 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 in risk. Uh, there will be a risk to the, to the uh, party uh, as well as the government of Maharashtra because then there will be two-third majority uh, with Eknath Chinde and then he can escape the anti-defection law. In fact, he can claim the party uh, to his own. Uh, the right. MLAs that are inside, uh, it was, there was an allegation by Shiv Sena that they are being held without, uh, their, uh, without their wish, without their will. But what we saw when four more right. MLAs joined uh, joined uh, these these rebel MLAs, they they came on their own. They were in a car. They they came and then they met the other MLAs that are inside that are in fact holed up inside. So uh, remains to be seen that what exactly is going to be the next step of Eknath Shinde. But uh, seems uh, the the numbers are right now in favor of Eknath Shinde.